Good morning, guys. 2006 build again. I think that's what we had yesterday. Um, flashings, exterior wall flashings. That's what keeps water out. You can't rely on <coughs> sealant because sealant has to be maintained. If you don't use the proper sealant, <clears throat> or even if you do use the proper sealant, it's going to crack on you. And that's why sealant can't be a substitute for proper wall flashings. <clears throat> so once again, wall flashings keep water from infiltrating into the wall cavity or, you know, behind the, uh, the exterior building envelope, behind the cladding. So let me turn this guy around here and uh, with my hand again. So if we look here, we've got a little, little closed in patio sunroom. And we look at the base of these windows and where it transitions to this J channel. What they really should have done is done a Z flashing. Behind this here, the flashing would have went on the wall. It would have come out over this J and, and needed to drop down. So where we don't have a flashing there, and there was never even sealant put there either. Um, but where we don't have it, guys, I don't know if y'all can see that back in there. If I'm even pointing the right direction with this camera. Let me see if I can multitask here. Flashlight and the video. But what you're looking at is that OSB is damaged by water behind there. And you know, that's, that's to be expected all the way around due to the missing flashing. Then we don't have proper flashing at the head of these windows. You know, you have to, Bruce Lee one time said, be like water. And, you know, you have to think, what's water going to do when it's raining? You know, gravity is always going to have water coming down. And so you have to imagine being water. So let's go right here. J-channel. It's going to act as a reservoir. It's going to catch it. Anywhere you have a split in the J-channel, water's really going to come out. And you can see where they've tried to seal this in the past. Water's going to come out. Come behind this. Go right back down in behind there. I mean, there's nothing to prevent it. Flashing is the most important component of an exterior wall, of a cladding system. And when it's missing, inadequate, unprofessionally installed, you're gonna have issues. Um, so I harp on flashing a lot and, and my background. I mean, that's, this is what I did was, was exterior claddings. Um, windows, exterior remodeling. I mean, I knew the importance of flashing. Then it's, uh, I'm gonna say this real quick. Um, I've been, been saying this a little bit recently. Why I see this stuff wrong all the time is men. Um, think of, of your husband or, or yourself, if you're a guy watching this, you get a desk from Ikea. Do you pull out that instruction book? Chuck it to the side, get your screwdriver out, you put that thing together. That's that man pride, if you will. So that's it's, the same concept applies to construction. Um, oh, we can put that up there. We don't need to read the details or the instructions. And they just do it. And that's why so many things are often wrong from an installation standpoint is pride and men knowing how or assuming they know how to do something. And yes, it may look nice, but will it perform? A lot of times not. Y'all have a great day. See you. Bye.